Hello, I'm Carol Chappelle, and I'm going to be doing the lecture today. Our topic is Technology for Teaching Reading. This lecture consists of six parts. In the first part, we'll look at the connection between technology and text today. Then we'll meet our reading expert, Professor Tammy Slater. Third, we'll ask Professor Slater to talk about why reading is important for students, and then what teachers should know about reading. Let's begin by looking at the connection between technology and text today. Technology provides access to many different materials for students to read. For example, on the Voice of America website, students can access stories about current events. Here is an example of a page from Voice of America, which has news stories that students and teachers can read and discuss. This particular page appeared shortly after the U.S. presidential election a few years ago, and it talks about the biggest picture on the page about President Obama's trip to Europe. But other things that are happening around the world are also reported. As you can see in this example, each of the stories that appears on the Voice of America webpage has written text about the story that students can read and discuss. Because technology provides access to so many different materials for students to read, teachers can select texts from the Internet for their students. We have two more examples of texts from the Internet, and again, these come from the U.S. government website, American English. There are two examples. One is called Four Friends, ages 13 and 14, and the second is The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. These two examples can be found at the American English website that all teachers and students have access to around the world. On that site, there's a number of resources for teachers. That middle section called Resources is where I found the two example texts. In the same place, teachers will be able to find different important and useful resources for each skill for both adults and for children. They can select the appropriate topics for their students by filtering their search for a particular audience ranging from adult learners to young learners, as you can see. By clicking on Resources, I'd find a lot of choices of things to read. One example is American Teens Talk. This is a collection of readings that's based on interviews of American high school students in both written and audio format. Each interview is accompanied by vocabulary notes and discussion questions, so it's a very useful tool for teaching reading. Here's an example of what one of the interviews looks like from this section of the text for friends, ages 13 and 14. The students are pictured there. Those are the four students who are friends, and they're asked questions such as, what have you been doing this week? Why are you making videos? What are you doing in school this week? Students can read about what American students are doing. 